Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing these two palettes with my Pan That palette. And I'm going in with Diffuse Place Warrior 3 palette in Bella Forever um, Volume 2. <laughs> So that is the three palettes I'll be working with because I'm going to use, see the five shades that I'll be using, but I'm going to be using two shades from each palette. So here is one palette, super beautiful, it has a lot of pressed glitters, <laughs> and this is a gorgeous palette, super cute, and of course, you can see right through this one, but Here's what the palette looks like. I'm going to focus on the ones that I have not gotten pan yet. So here we go. One through five. So we have three and two. One through nine, five and nine. One through 63, we have 34. And I didn't see the last one. There's a commercial. Um, 52. Here's the color story. I really like it a lot. It's mostly mattes and one shimmer, which is nice. I do like my mattes. Um, you could just see how they swatch. This was from this palette. <laughs> the second two are right here, the blue and the purple were from this palette and of course the last one would have to be from these two from this palette those are the swatches so far i like these swatches more and then these and then these are the last <laughs> but i am excited for what to create on my eyes today okay for the inner portion i'm gonna go in with this ice pop shade for the inner part of the crease. I like halfway. Going in with Pinky Promise, this is a green shade right here. Surprised I didn't get any um pressed glitters, which is good because but I would know where to put them. So I'm going in with Pinky Promise. It's a huge palette. <laughs> so I did actually more than half. Kind of Christmassy look, but since we have so much color, it won't be as like a Christmas look. That's what it's looking like. Going in with this purple right here, so beautiful. This palette is gorgeous. And then just going in the outer portion. Just going in, not all the way. Going in with this blue right here. Next to the purple. That blue is so pretty. I kind of did more purple in because I messed up. <laughs> so my John, um, he bought me an iPhone 12 with like 256 gigabytes, something like that. 
So I'm excited. It'll come in next week when I have my appointments. So that's pretty exciting to have something so big like that come in. I'm like, oh, yay. <laughs> and two palettes are coming in, which I don't need, but you know, they looked beautiful. I'm just going to go in, not all the way. <laughs> going in with wine, this color right here, this beautiful pink, and it did not swatch well, so we will see how it performs. And I already did um, my glitter glue. So let's see, and everything was used by this one detailed brush. So let's see how this works. Not too bad. Not too bad. Now I'm going in with the strawberry lemonade right here. The more of a detail brush. I need to wash my brushes today. It is a nice Sunday. Like, I felt like doing my makeup. Usually, I just stay in bed. But today, I felt like doing my makeup, getting ready for nothing. Just gonna wash my brushes, make myself something to eat. That's about it for my day. Like, tuna casserole, a cold dish. For... You know, dinner, I guess. <laughs> so that is what it's looking like. I really like it. It's fun. It's colorful. I love all my colors. Um, What I want to do is put in this purple with the Juvia's Place palette in the outer portion. Going in with the wine color from that big Bella Forever palette. And look at that pigmentation on here. Let's see if it does good with the smaller brush. But it did pretty good up here. Just in the rest of the way. I was going to put like a bit of blue right there, but I was like, no, nah, that'll probably look silly. going to use this liquid eyeliner I got from Dollar Tree a while back. I'm just going in. Like that. Nope. Nothing fancy. <laughs> I can't do wings. So this is the final look. What do you think? I kind of do enjoy it because it's fun, colorful, and finally we get like a pretty good colorful story. I do like it. Um, So this palette is really, really good. I am just like drugstore brands sometimes aren't my thing, but this performs really good. It's Those shimmer shades are really creamy. Um, I'm getting closer and closer to getting that dip and hitting pan because oh, I can't wait. <laughs> so this is a really good palette. If you're looking for like a $10 palette from the, the drugstore, this reminds me like of spring. If you're not into like colorful eye looks like I am, this is great for a neutral girl. You'll, you'll enjoy that. Um, as for colorful palettes, this is a really good I love the blue and that purple is really good. Even though it didn't swatch is really good, it performs really good on the eye. I really do enjoy these big pans and these, these color stores are really pretty. Um, I highly recommend the Juvia's Place. And this is really good. I really did like, I do love like a big palette with full of colors. Um, this performed okay, not the best, but you, it's an indie brand, it's a hit or miss, 
to me and this is like quite in the middle of what I like. Um, it swatched like poorly but it did do its job on applying on the eye. I really do like the color story a lot. I don't care how small the pans are but I do like like the color story. Um, other than that, they all did a really good job with this eye look today. I really did enjoy doing this eye look. So thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment to my channel. Bye for now.